We like old adverts. Hello everyone and happy Christmas. Welcome to We Like Old Adverts. I'm Joe, joined by Jim and Connell. Yeah, we're doing our advert calendar. We have got a treat for you right now because this one is hateful. I hate everyone behind this advert. I have everyone in it. I hate everyone who's influenced by it. Don't change your Christmas. Just play. Traditionally so cliche. Didn't want to do it, so I sold my sleigh and I came to slay. No ho ho ho. Bringing something different and it's bold, ice cold. Swapping tap for taste. Take it to the max for the holidays. Fizzing it, sipping it, it's that time. Do it how you want, just don't compromise. Refresh your Christmas with Pepsi Max. Maximum taste, no sugar. Have a bit of respect, Pepsi. Have a bit of respect, come on. Don't compromise, shut up. The rest yeah. of the saying don't compromise whilst demanding we compromise throughout the advert. Yeah, I mean, it's funny, isn't it? Because they, they are saying like, do something a little bit different by drinking one of the most popular drinks in the world. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. But if I may kind of try and defend this advert a little bit, which is sure. hard because it is so terrible and horrible to watch. I think the line traditional is so cliche is interesting, right? Because Pepsi have backed into a corner at Christmas, right? They've got a look at Coke and the way Coke have just inserted themselves into Christmas with so many iconic adverts and that myth about them kind of, you know, making Santa Claus red, all that stuff. They've got a look at that and gone, how have you done that? How? It's, it's fizzy, slightly caramelly, slightly mysterious brown drink. Why does everyone associate it with Christmas? How have you... <clears throat> so if Pepsi try and do anything Christmassy, all they do is remind people that they're not Coke. So they have to do something like this. And um, they've done a terrible job of it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> no, that was cooking. It, right? Oh, it's... Don't... Uh, the point of Christmas is tradition that's the entire yeah. premise of it but can you imagine pepsi max pepsi max becoming part of your we all like pepsi max we all <laughs> like pepsi max oh i, I love this i thought pepsi max was a big deal when it came out because it was like it's it's basically coke sorry pepsi but it is uh, but there's no sugar in it so it's healthy ah got you there mum got you there mum <laughs> And it was advertised in a real kind of gnarly surfer dude, kind of extreme yeah. sports way in the early 90s, wasn't it? Ah! Like, yeah. yeah, maximum taste, zero sugar. All right, Pepsi Max, take life to the max. I remember people going like, oh, yeah, I've tried Pepsi Max. It's, it's well nice. It isn't. It tastes like uh, <laughs> It's nice around Christmas time, though. <laughs> <laughs> Christmas is cancelled. It's you imagine cancelled. what Christmas they come up with looks like. Them two on the advert. Like, they like having a Christmas, like, on a street corner. <laughs> like, Modern popping. Yeah, like, yeah. getting so served. cool and so street. And, like, yeah, I don't, I don't want to swap traditional for a hoodie. <laughs> yeah, swapping tap for taste. It's like you've got a cartoon no. hoodie on, mate. I'll yeah. take the tap. I'll, where, what are you yeah. doing with your tat? I'll have that. <laughs> where do you stand on contrived rapping in adverts, Con? I know you hate poetry oh, in adverts. Yeah. So um, cousin. Well, this is dressed up as rap, isn't it? But it's just poetry done wrong. <laughs> like, nothing rhymes in it. There's not, not a single rhyme in that. Um, uh, it's all I've, accent. It's just accent. Their accents yeah. sound like it rhymes, but <laughs> you listen to the words. They're not rhymes. That doesn't actually rhyme. She, did, she does say something about um, how she sold her sleigh. Oh, so like, uh, Jim, it rhymes throughout. <laughs> there are loads of rhymes in it. Yeah. Not nah, me. not for me. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you can't choose what does and doesn't rhyme. <laughs> this doesn't rhyme, I can assure you. That is not a hill I've you can die it. on. It's I've so easy it. to prove wrong. Traditionally so cliche. Didn't want to do it, so I sold my sleigh. Her saying that she sold her sleigh, does that imply that she, she's Santa? <laughs> Mm. That's quite a cool. No, I, th I don't think she was Santa. She just invested heavily into becoming Santa, and it went horribly wrong for her. She so actually, so she's she's been burned quite badly by tradition. Mm. So again, if we actually look at this with some sympathy, then maybe she's right to be rejecting Christmas in the way that she is. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. I'm really. I don't know why I'm trying to defend yeah, this advert. You're out to bat for this advert, aren't you? It's more like a sort of thought exercise for me, just to see if I can do it. And I think what we're <laughs> seeing is that I can't. 
<laughs> I'm so glad I'm not a young person these days. If I'm being talked to like that, you know, I, I'd be furious. I don't, just don't patronize me, you second tier soft drink. You know, I, it, it's if young people aren't detached enough at the minute. They're being encouraged to eschew Christmas for pop. You know, oh God. It's, I, honestly, I want to no platform Christmas. I hate, I loathe this advert with everything I have. Don't compromise, mate. <laughs> Could you imagine that? The person who doesn't compromise at Christmas. Christmas is about compromising. Because yeah, yeah. everyone's families are difficult. Yeah. <laughs> no offence, Joe. But everyone's <laughs> families are really difficult, aren't they, all the time? <laughs> Well, that's the worst one of all these advert calendar examples, I think. But uh, yeah, I hope you liked it. And uh, promise tomorrow's is going to be a bit brighter. But uh, yeah, uh, check us with us tomorrow. I'd be lovely to see you again. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Uh, yeah, send us a little email if you want to recommend one. And other than that, have a glorious Christmas and an average New Year. <laughs>